finish off talking uh going through twitter and seeing how twitter reacted to the game yesterday so if you bring it on you see this is uh the first one that we're going to go through it's hyung min son uh talking about Richarlison, and he's saying seeing Richarlison's score felt better than me scoring Richarlison has had difficulties since last week and i've been thinking about how i could help him he is a talented friend and it was unfortunate that he was blaming himself due to the bad luck and other reasons i know how it feels and i I've experienced similar difficult times so I hope he can show a stronger side and grow after today's game and I think we're all feeling like that aren't we yeah and it's so great to hear the captain speak like that and you saw after the game I think maybe there's a clip of it uh, which will which will come up um which we'll see, but uh, I thought I thought it's so nice to see um, him kind of showing encouragement, um, even though technically he's like competition for him in the starting eleven, like just in, like showing the love and showing the support and and dragging him to the to the Spurs fans after the game as well to make sure that he's feeling the love, and it was just great to see. Uh, I found this one really funny from Project Football, a meme from um, from them from Four Lions when they're all in the car singing, dancing in the moonlight, <laughs> and um, the one in the front is just not. Having happy at all and the rest of them are just uh, screaming it and you've got Man United uh, being the unhappy one and then Man City, Tottenham and Liverpool uh, just dancing away Amazing. and I thought that was brilliant. Absolutely brilliant, absolutely <laughs> love that. Um, My favourite memes that one. Ethan says uh, Peter Banks the worst refereeing display in Premier League history just look how many bookings on the day I mean one two 13. three four well I don't need to count them 13 <laughs> bookings 13. on the day unbelievable it's a crazy amount I wonder when the last time there was that many bookings in a game yeah crazy uh, next up from the Spurs Army saying good night Tottenham Hotspur fans with Bissouma and Hyung Min Son um, going for it into the camera brilliant stuff um, this is what togetherness looks like in the squad and you just see all the team, Mickey van der Ven, Saar, literally all of them just um, on top of the world after scoring that winner while the game is still going on. It's great stuff there. Absolutely fantastic. I think, I think this is, um, yeah, this is when um, full time, yeah, full time everyone celebrates. Absolutely fantastic to see. One thing I did notice, I don't have read too much to it, much into it, but like no one really went up to Eric Dyer. He was kind of very much. Low I didn't. Low I didn't actually. One. I didn't actually realize until now that he was on the bench yesterday. Yeah, and Ashley Phillips bench. wasn't. Yeah, which I told you, he's going to be our backup centre back. Which I don't is agree, not man. Great, but it is what it is. But yeah, it's great to see the togetherness in the squad, isn't it? And they're all, they're all hugging each other. There's a great clip I get. I will get to. I think as well, Valise, but we'll see. Uh, this is the future from the Spurs watch with a doggy van der Ven, Kulisevsky, Saar and Brennan Johnson all having a hug. I think must yeah, have been after De Decky scored. And all those players, Johnson's 22, Saar's 20, Kulisevsky's 23, van der Ven 22 and Udogi 20. So like that, that's that's like that is literally the future of Spurs, right? The now, future so. is bright. The future is lily white. Uh, this was the penalty decision from Madison. Look, that's a clear kick in the back of the ankles. I just don't understand how that's not a penalty. I thought it was a stone wall up. Look at it. Yeah, Boom. it's a penalty. It's a penalty. I don't know why VAR not getting involved if it's not being seen. That should be a penalty, 100%. Uh, next up is uh, I'm Loving Big Ange instead, shot by Ben Haynes, the South Stand, just um, oh, in fun. full voice. Listening to this. Can, you, can, I want, can they hear it? It's, such, yeah. it's so great. It's brilliant. I just love they were playing Angels uh, um, after the game and then you got the fans bellowing it out. Absolutely. I found it weird though because it was like um, when the song was going on people were actually singing like the Angels lyrics. Do, do they start literally from the start of the song? No. no I no. sit and wait. They yeah. didn't no, stop from no, that. Okay, no. good. That might have uh, been a bit awkward. No, they brought, <laughs> they brought it on from that. But actually people were singing the actual Angels lyrics and not the Angels lyrics. Oh, really? And then when it came to the end the whole stadium in unison just sing, sang I'm loving Big Angel instead. Maybe, maybe they just don't know that maybe not enough fans know the lyrics yet. Yeah. Um, next up, this is Dejan Kulisevsky's game by numbers, 62 touches, 34 final third passes, 14 touches in the opposition box, which is the most, seven shots, which is the most, five chances created, which is the most, three big chances, which is the most, two shots on target and one goal. Gimme, gimme, a ginger from Sweden. Fantastic stuff. Lovely stuff. Um, 
And this is the um, big. I mean, I can't yeah, watch can't the watch whole thing, yeah. but go and watch. Go to Bain Haynes's uh, Twitter. You'll see the whole it's interview there. Interview. It really it's is. Really it really is. Um, and Ben Haynes just says, watch all of this. He is absolutely amazing. And he absolutely. most definitely is. Lee McQueen saying, this guy has been a first class signing, celebrating the winner too. Absolutely class. He just ran the absolute length of the pitch when we scored that winner. Yeah, one of the best things I've seen. Yeah, 100%. <laughs> Um, next up is The Athletic saying... Um, no, I think we can skip past that. Oh, we can skip that past that one, Simeon says. We've seen that picture already. And this is the whole Spurs team. Absolute bedlam in the Spurs stadium. Where, uh, Sheffield United players down to their feet, down to the ground as Spurs, as the whole stadium just absolutely picture. erupts. What a picture. Look at that. Yeah. that is that it? Oh, man. It's like a... You know, remember that um, when we played Chelsea that one time at Stamford Bridge and all those amazing pictures were coming out? I just I, I This just is like the polar there. opposite. Yeah, it's the opposite. <laughs> but I just love, I love like snapshots in time of sort of things like that. It's just brilliant. Yeah. And you see all the fans going crazy. All the players don't know what they're doing. All the dejection of Sheffield United. It's great. What a great picture. And the next one is Sonny is the captain we've needed for years. And I actually think like he's showing like more leadership qualities. I know Kane was never our captain, but he was definitely a leader on the pitch than, than Kane ever did yeah I, I agree with that I think Sonny is more of a captain to like bring everyone together Kane was like a captain leading by example like look how look at my professionalism like how good I am kind of thing but Sonny is more of a guy who I think like gets more camaraderie out of everyone I never felt like Kane was that kind of character and he like he like um since he's been given the captain's armband He's actually like really proud. You can really see that mm. he's so proud to be this club's captain where I've never really felt about that in a way of a Spurs captain ever before. Mm, I think you're probably right about that. Um, next up, this is FPL saying this age well. Richarlison was Spurs' most sold player of game week five. He earned a golden assist. The most bought players all blanked. If that isn't FPL in a nutshell, we don't know what is. <laughs> Unbelievable. That. The most sold player. Love that. I can't, that's that, um, that's kicking the teeth whoever sold him <laughs> who sold him did I you sell him, him? No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> who did you sell him for Madison because I didn't because I got well, Madison got injured I took him out and then I kept Richarlison in and I, then I took out Richarlison put Madison in so you're one of those players I am, I am. <laughs> <laughs> so you had him in there for the first four games of the season yep. and sold him for this one correct <laughs> <laughs> that's what you get uh -huh. That's what you get. Um, Hotspur related saying Tottenham comeback today was their 100th Premier League win after conceding the first goal. The only other team to reach such a milestone is Manchester United with 103 victories. Love that. That's good. Good stat. Um, this is from Tobes, um, just Basuma dancing in front oh, of the uh, the South Stand yesterday. Absolutely love that. I mean, he no, is so just becoming such a hero for Spurs, yeah, isn't he? He loves a good dance with the fans, doesn't he? He does it every game. It's actually fantastic. Um, this is from Poisonden ITK. You don't Poseidon. ever forget Poseidon. Uh, you don't ever forget every masterpiece with a picture of Richarlison has its cheap copy with Kane, <laughs> Lewandowski, <laughs> R9, Haaland, and Mbappe. <laughs> come on, come on. Um, this is Tottenham Hotspur. Madison. I mean, Madison was getting so frustrated on the pitch yesterday. Yeah, he was, he was threatening to boil over at one point. But um, but then as soon as we got those winners, I mean, you just saw all of that stress just release. 100%. I think that's probably the same with all of us. <laughs> um, Billy T saying, a couple of underrated shouts for Perisic, who was an excellent when he came on. Udogi, who started the second goal. And Van der Ven, who was just brilliant all game. Really liked the Johnson cameo too. What a time to be alive. This is... Um, unbelievable unbelievable uh, Spurs Express just a picture of Brennan Johnson saying Brennan loving it already um, I, lo I, lo I loved his uh, post-match interview as well he just seemed like a um, a schoolboy uh, just coming yeah. through like really nervous and, and stuff it was just brilliant to he see he said he was nervous before he came yeah. on he said which is interesting but yeah. didn't seem it yeah, uh, Football Away Day saying some of the best limbs I've ever seen from a home end impressive and yeah. it really was. I'm it really was. Let's it, just but... see the limbs again. Boom. But let's move on quickly. No, I don't even could show it. Um, next up is Billy, Billy T. Vicario when we scored. <laughs> <laughs> I love this. Absolutely love that. Absolutely love that. <laughs> Brilliant. 
Next up is uh, Tottenham with Ballers with Richarlison and Decky. Love that. And Decky had some uh, great words from for Richarlison after the game as well. What did he say? I didn't see that. What did he say? Oh, did you not say he was? He was just talking about how much of a top player he is, and um, you know, people are judging him a bit too early. And um, I can't remember the exact words that he said, but it was off the ilk. It was just like, just keep supporting him. Uh, he's oh, a great player. I love that. I love that. Um, the armed forces as well, the most joyous and chaotic celebrations you'll see. Uh, this is the rabbi um, in the concourse as well. And it's oh. great to see the rabbi uh, really celebrating like that because I don't know if you guys know, but he did have a heart attack. Uh, if you scroll down, Sam, yeah, this video, the, the rabbi, he did have a heart attack a couple of weeks ago. So it's great to see him in, uh, in, in good uh, spirits with Looks his hat on a stick. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Looks to be enjoying himself. Shoot up to the rabbi. Um, next up is Alex Mitten, strong contender for best of the season. Go on, silence. Yes, I oh, <laughs> love yeah, that. Watch that, absolutely fantastic. <laughs> oh, there's so many clips of when that goal goes in and uh, the, the, the the scenes. It's just that's so great to see. Next the up is um, the Angie area. All the fat, all the players um, going in unison towards the south stand, and uh, with the celebrations going on. And this is a great clip from Alejo Valiz, the way he was uh, celebrating one, after yeah, the game. This one is great. You can see here if you if you um, if you see in the background, he's the one with the cap, the flat cap behind, and he's going nuts. It's absolutely <laughs> fantastic. Saying, well, Brian Hill as well. Yeah, Brian Hill. Everyone's saying this is Valise's first experience of the Tottenham Stadium. Great to see. And then you've got Bentancur, Phillips as well, uh, next to each other as well, going crazy. Bentancur's going out, and then you also obviously you've got Postecoglou there. You've got to try to make out what's behind it but it's great absolutely love fantastic Poster Coglu uh, when they asked him after the game was like why weren't you celebrating the goal too much he's like I had to had to sort out the back four mate yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, got, got back in there brilliant <laughs> um, what have we got here I'm just starting out but I love the guys at We Are Tottenham that's something else uh, expressions delete the slander you had ready to send to me <laughs> that was lovely <laughs> I love that um, is that it he, uh, what, there's a couple more if you go down Luca uh, this is the this Son one, yeah, yeah. yeah this is Son pushing Richarlison towards yeah, the south great, stand what a great moment this was brilliant moment that's the, that is just what captains made that, that's proper captain material from uh, from Sonny look at that just making sure Richarlison gets the adulation he deserved after that cameo and it's just great I love to see that the players going over to the fans and just showing their appreciation it's so great to see um, and then if you scroll a bit down to uh, the Jacko one about Kulisevsky um, let the praise be as loud as the disrespect my star boy um, and that's obviously a testament to the way Decky played yesterday so brilliant stuff and I think that is pretty much yeah, it yeah that's it that's pretty much it. So that is how Twitter reacted.